Hey everybody, uh, this is the first battle for Corn's Commandos, designated KK on the map in Blue Sector. Um, so they had no idea that the um, gun position, the heavy naval battery, was surrounded by fortifications. So Corn's Commandos and a few other units ended up, actually all the other units in Blue Sector, ended up landing on uh, enemy bases. So now are forced to take them out. Fortunately, I've been bouncing back and forth between systems trying to find a, an attack base, base mission at Two Skulls, and I've been having an impossible time finding it. So, I was able to find a blackout mission at Two Skulls, so that's what I'm going to roll with with this one. Um, and for other people that are having problems finding the missions that you need to, just kind of roll with it. Um, take what you can. It's not going to be perfect, and that's okay. Um, well, we're, we're still working on ironing out all the bugs for this, so, um, actually, we don't want to get you too close. Let's put you, I think, here for now. And let's move you up here as well. Moving to position. So, yeah, if you're working out, if you're working um, to try and get the best missions you can, great. Um, but if you can't find them, just go with what you can. Don't go bankrupt trying to find missions. Um... So yeah, that's my suggestion. Like I said, I bounced between one, so one, two, three, four. This is the fifth jump. I'm I'm at a position now where I'm between two planets that are ten days apart that are both two skulls. So I've been kind of fortunate, but still, it's like I literally went to two financial reports, trying to um, get a mission that I could use, and then I finally was able to get a two skull blackout mission. So that's what we're going with with this one. So, okay, so uh, with this particular map, we got one of two things is going to happen. One of these turrets are going to activate and attack us, or two, they're going to get drop hards. Um, so, I'm thinking probably the best bet is to maneuver. I think this will activate for one. We're moving to position here. Acknowledged. That one or two units, okay. And then Tomahawk, you're going to wait. You're going to wait to see what we get. Good Cover Girl, go. you're going to go gonna sprint. Oh, we can't get up there, eh? I'm gonna turn here. I copy. And we'll see what happens. Two and two. Okay. Got drop pods? Nope. Alright, so we are against turrets. We gotta take this base down. Alright, let's get into position so we can do that. So this is Shredder turret, probably an AC20. Goss emplacement equally bad. Another shredder turret with those are probably SRMs, and a laser turret with I don't know what. All right, so let's get. We're gonna go before the turrets, so let's get some movement on. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, you stay with him. It's been interesting running the playthrough. This is I'm running the playthrough for Fists of Dorn. Confirmed. Based on the notes he's given me, let's put you here. On my way. Put you here. For I'm now, hurt. these two vehicles are very fragile, so moving them close is a bad idea. So these turrets are up now. All right. Um, so yeah, it's been interesting playing based on the notes he's given me. What's up, boss? All right, we want to try and strike as many turrets. How much armor do you have? 240. Let's do this smart. Last time we was on a mission like this, we, I got enemy drop pods. And we were placed over here with our backs up the, up the ramp here. And then the drop pods showed up here. Urban Mech with an MRM-30. SRM Carrier was here. Ostrock was here. And um, yeah, we tried to take the SRM Carrier out, but it, it ended up killing, ripping the Hunchback's side off. That and the MRM-30 Irby. And we lost the Pirate Ultra 10 off of that. But in that same mission, that we, we picked up an Ostrock, so it was totally worth it. All right. We're going to go on this turret here, get rid of this Goss Rifle. Whatever you say, boss. We're going to back up. Waiting for orders. Okay, let's see what we can do. On the move. We're back Full up to speed. here. 
the best chance to hit. We'll go with Cluster to get as many of them on there as possible. Wow, did, oh, we, did we hit the building? Or did we hit this turret? Oh, it was the building, okay. I thought we hit the other turret with the second up, one. Alright, you... You did not be anywhere near these guys. For the moment. Go back here. So this thing's got four flamers and a tag on it. Thing is, is that... If it moves in... Waiting for orders. It's going to get targeted. Maybe. This way, when it's back there, it can move next turn and get more evasion. You need to get jump jets on this thing. One thing it's missing. Okay, if we go here... I think we go against this other Copy turret. That. And then we'll use the TBM carrier to shoot up the this guy here. Probably the best route. Just don't shoot your own guy in the back. Fuck, really? Losing armor. Like honestly, 75% chance to hit. Are you serious? Yes, Commander. FFS, baby! Alright, well, let's target this guy. That didn't hit? I don't know what it is about this unit, I can do. but the high percentage chances to hit have just been, like, tanking continuously. 70% on this guy, but I think we could probably... Kill this Goss turret. Let's do that because it's got direct line of sight and it's a lot of damage. Giving them everything I've got. Come on. Not enough. Critical hit, Commander. Well, it's having the same problem we are. Building's in the way. All right, yeah, these guys are. Oh, those are SRMs. Yeah, they are. All right, let's kill these guys. Yes, Commander. All right, we want the Goss turret gone and this Shredder turret gone. So Goss turret's got how much left? Mm, about 60, probably 75, 60, somewhere in there. Stay out of the way of that other turret. Go after this guy. Firing all weapons. Yes, Commander. Heading out. A little shuffle backwards is hilarious. Uh, you could probably do enough. Ah. Wow, you see that angle? <laughs> the cluster angle break. One less turret. It's like gu guided, cl guided cluster. All right, now we want to take this other turret. Ready for orders. Can we do it in a way that we can't be seen by? Missile turrets. I don't think so. Let's hope we can get behind it here. That's just suicide. And if we miss, we're opening ourselves up to targeting here. So it's already got a really good chunk of damage on it. We're going to have direct fire from the Ostrock. You know what? Let's hold off on the Owens. Let's see where we're at. We'll reserve this. We'll see where we're at when we get Cover Girl. What's up, Bach? Hammering this turret. Yeah, fuck you. That looks just like a bad position to be in. I wish you could angle it like this and not have to worry about hitting your own mechs. Position confirmed. But that's not the case. All right, no back shots, please. Beautiful. Pop 
popped it like a zit. One left turret. Okay. Now I've got the far turret to go for. I live to serve. So Hawk, his the vehicle we want to get for this guy eventually. Locking on. Nice. Um, did we actually hit that? We did. Um, the vehicle we want to get for this guy Order. eventually is going to be. You're going to reserve again. Is going to be a. Um, yeah. What can I do you for? A VTOL, and we want to get a heavy tank here for. Um, for this route. Kinetic goes through the armor. Faint is harder to shoot down than Inferno. So if we go... Too standard. Yeah, let's just fire all standard. Screw it. More than enough. One less turret. I'm really liking this carrier, I gotta say. I've been proxy playing these these guys Waiting for quite for a while it. now, and I'm really enjoying that carrier. Okay, sir, can't see us with the movement here for Let's now. Go. Pounce on this turret with energy weapons next turn. All right. Standing by. Energy only. Save the ammo. Actually, it doesn't really matter with the, uh, with the with this guy, but yeah, good practices. Oh crap! Really, really. Commander. Burn the ammo then. Acknowledged. This thing is slow when it's hot. Okay, let's shred this turret. Uh, Sure. On it. Standing by. PPC master, destroy faster. Acknowledged. Yeah, this guy's got good targeting. We're gonna we're gonna overheat on this one a little bit. We're okay with I that. Got we wanna kill this guy. Flamer should finish Target's it off. Taking a critical hit. I'm here. Alright, let's get moving. Get off this hill. On my way. Double not gonna time. shoot because back shots. You know me in back Standing shots. By. You know me. Let's not have a building in the way. There we go. Roger that. Burn. Firing on target. All right. Moving up to the next base. All right. Here we are. We're gonna park up here. Make sure we got everybody up to the top. On my way. Almost all there. Position confirmed. Now we are. Location confirmed. Excellent. Acknowledged. So these guys are pretty much heavy brawlers. Let's get to here. I don't know if they're going to come in the base or they're going to spawn down below, but no problem. On see my what way. happens here. Okay, it's drop ship. What do we got down here? Cataphract, Whitworth, Chameleon, and a Merlin. All right. Um, Hatchet Man needs to be in striking range. What I might do is run him up along here and then jump down. Um, Ostrock. Moving now, out. Owens is designed to overheat mechs to slow them down so the Hatchet Man can murder them. That's what we're going to try and use it for in this battle. On the move. These two vehicles, I want to just try and keep alive. Let's go. All right, the cataphract is the uh, thing we got to kill here first. They've got a pretty good lance here, so I'm interested to see how this battle turns out. I don't know what our turrets are. Looks like we got might have a Goss back here. What do we got on our side? Goss emplacement. So we can't be make make sure that's we're not between it and uh, them. Medium and two light rifles, so nothing really. AC two turret. Yeah, I think that's it. And it's just the three. Okay. Just waiting for orders.
They're gonna shoot for the buildings first. So let's get into here. Copy that. We just captured their base. They're gonna try and retake it. Story wise. So let's go ahead. These guys haven't moved, so there's no point in trying to target them because it's just gonna be relatively low. We can get a quick kill on this guy. It's a lot of energy. Low armor too. Ooh, say goodbye to your leg, buddy. Solid. Commander. Okay, I'm gonna run you down here for now. On my way. Every mech in this lance has got jump jets except for the Ostrock, which is it's kind of scheduled to get jump jets. Uh, we're gonna try for the leg. Fail. Fail. Target is taking a critical nope. hit. Merlin. Yeah, this carrier is like a target all the time. So it has to always be moving to at least generate some kind of evasion. Orders. So can we get you a direct line of sight? We can if... Well, it's actually not... I don't think the Goss Rifle can see those guys. Full speed. Not this turn anyway. Yeah, not this turn. Go for the leg. Target is flying. Come on, come on. There we go. Ah, cord it. Damn it. One left target. Well, last mech we gotta worry about. Yeah, see, they're going after the building. Fabulous! Our building is gone! Okay. Receiving you. Mrs. Mamba. We have the advantage of these guys going for the building, so not that worried about her right now. It's the 35 ton Owens, too, so it can take a little bit of damage. 35 tons is kind of on the border of taking, like, medium. Oh, that's a pirate version. DC-10 spiky, huh? It's on the border of being able to take an okay amount of punishment. Yeah, we're going to burn this guy to a cinder, then we're going to chop him apart with the axe man. Okay, who's up? Uh... Ready for orders. Hawkman. Okay, I was worried about putting the vehicle... I'm putting stuff between us and our own turrets. But I don't think they've... Um, they haven't gone far enough yet. For that back turret to do anything. That's the close turret with the rifles. So it went against this guy, eh, Merlin? Ready for orders. Make sure we move, get some at least some evasion. Trees for defense. Now we're gonna rain some thermal on this guy. The only thing I hate about this vehicle is like taking forever to switch them all over ammo-wise. And we'll just lob this stuff on him. Fire at all. We've only got a couple of turns of full fire with the thermo. Fifty-three heat. How, does, how you like me now, baby? All right. Um, who's up? Okay. Uh, Waiting for orders. Um, you're not going to get to him this turn. That puts those rifles between us and them, though. You know what? Let's reserve this for a second. Reserving action. You're not. It's going to be another turn before we can get to the melee wise. But I don't want to be between. Keep shooting for the carrier, that's good. 
I don't want to be between those Minimal rifles. Although, you know what? The rifles aren't going to do that much damage. Ready to get it on. The medium rifle does, what, 45? It's like an AC-5. Get into here. Okay. Um, let's try this. Taking the shot. Sure. Torsos are fine. Commander. As long as you're hitting. That's all that matters. Ah, uh, this little thing here. 64. 75. Let's get into here. Hopefully we don't, we don't get attacked by uh, friendly fire by accident here. But I think we're fine. we got good stability. So let's go after this guy. Four hits with the flamers. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh, but apparently you can melee. Somehow have you have got the speed for that. Because of course you do. Not against five chevrons of evasion, you're not. You did drop a little bit of heat, but not enough that's going to make a difference. Yeah, you better back up. Well, I can't use the... Uh, Systems are holding. Thermal right now. Good to go. Yeah, you attack Black, Black Mamba, you're going to get yourself in a little trouble here. Let's get into here. Going to turn the axe arm more towards the turret. Wait. Yeah, because we're taking damage on the other arm. Friendly fire damage, too, nonetheless. Um... Yeah, I don't want to go after the cataphractus yet. That would be a bad. Receiving you. I just, I was just thinking, it's just looking at friendly fire. I'm like, yeah, I don't think so. Although this Understood. shouldn't be that bad. But the uh, arrow ammo, it's like, yeah, it's pretty accurate. I think we're okay with the PPC as well. We're gonna fire everything, and let's put sensors down there. We're gonna be jumping out of there next turn anyway, so we'll not to worry about sensors. On it. Oh, we finally got a leg hit, eh? Ooh, what the hell just happened? Right leg, right torso. Okay, damage transferred into this. All right, we must have triggered ammo. Prototype double heat sinks. What's up, Commander? Not mean to do that. Move forward a little Move bit. Out. How hot are you? You're not hot at all. Merlin's not hot either. Let's just switch this back to standard. We've got two two more turns of firing. We'll lob some rounds on this guy. Two, three, four. Now we got four of them. That's not bad. I'm your spaniel. Okay, Hawk. No back Onward. shots. Nice hit. Yeah. Ooh. This guy's getting punished. Receiving you. Alright, you you do have the ability to melee. We're gonna be going through sensors, but I don't care. See? Why can't I use the physical weapon? But I can here. Attacking him straight on, I can't use a physical weapon, but I can from the side. And the back. I, I don't. I'm at a loss. I don't know. I don't even know what to say. I think you're still working on it. Nice. Open him up, and then... Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Wait, that's us. So the AC landed on the on the uh, leg, hatchet in the back torso. Yes, Commander. Here. 
Did you launch that? Get some flames on this guy and a tag. There you go, four more. Not giving him much though. Got something you want done? Yeah, we got some we got some mechs to kill. On the move. I want to use the Donald because I'm going to screw up sensors here. But that 99% chance to hit. We're so close to the uh, victory here. Large cam lasers. Let's, yeah, let's just do it. Oh, God, oh, can't get the other, really? Let's just shoot this guy. Let's get rid of him. Copy that. <sighs> that hit something good. Standing by. The other thing too about playing Heading a proxy out. lance, it's it's weird because it's like sometimes I, I won't do things that I would personally do, only because I'm afraid of like losing somebody else's stuff. If that makes any sense. I'm playing with somebody else's toys, technically. Fun. So I always feel bad when I lose something, right? Like, oh, I should have been more cautious. But all I can do is try and play like the Lance is intended to be played. It's tough. And this is the kind of thing here that I'm worried... I... Commander. Yeah. I, I, I'm wounded. When you're playing melee mechs... Like, this is the kind of thing that you have to worry about all the time, is them meleeing back and doing a shit ton of damage. Commander? It's been rough, because I'm not used to playing like a, like a very, like a brawler kind of lance. I'm going. So, and when you get them in close, you gotta worry about friendly fire issues too, right? So, like, now let's see how the you Axe Man this. is like brutal, because it's got the, the, the uh, LBX, right? But if I'm meleeing, and I miss, and I had another guy there that was meleeing, I might actually hit the other mech, right, with the AC, with the AC-20. So, yes, come you in. really gotta think about what it is you're doing here. See ya. Locking in all weapon systems. This thing is brutal. I hope we can salvage that. Yeah, we don't, we don't want Whitworth. We, we don't want Whitworth in our uh, roster here. Alright. Ready. Yeah, nobody attacks Black Mamba like that. Not, that's not what we allow thing people to do. See, now, here's the thing. I could do this, I could do a back strike and go with the LBX, but then if I miss, right, there's the chance to hit her. And even here, well, I guess it's probably like almost no chance. That's the, yeah, we're gonna go after this side. Physical weapon, attack. Roger that. Roger. Beautiful. Yeah, see ya. Target. You don't punch Black Mamba. That's not how it works. Mission successful. So yeah, I mean, I guess, I guess those um, blackout missions can be used in replace of a um, destroy base. Although destroy base is harder because you're facing mechs and turrets at the same time. Um. Yeah, I mean, I guess if there's just like no other choice, so yeah, I just kind of go for it. All right, cataphract. We can't assemble it before the end of this campaign anyway. Well, we can we can grab the part because um, we're technically in supply, so we can pick it up. Prototype double heat sinks. AC twenty flak. I think we're gonna grab a prototype double heat sink here. I think that's probably the best of the best. Although the ER mediums, wait, these are like, are these the 5% uh, multiplier to charge attack damage, minus 5 multiplier to charge self. You know what, let's grab one of the, actually, uh, too bad the spiky AC-10 didn't survive. Oh well, grab one of these because it is a melee item in this lance, it's more uh, in close melee lance, so. Alright, so we got a few things here, Gauss Rifle, these guys can go, 100 core can go. Standard can go. Heavy jump jets will hang on to. And the spiked helmet will definitely hang on to. And we got a protect double heatsink. So that actually worked out not bad. 
All right, so we'll end it here. Uh, next mission is most likely for for Corn's commandos. Most like or sorry, Corn's uh, Conrad's commandos is most likely going to be um, a three skull fixed um, mobile unit. So that'll be a nice tough battle. Um, but we're going to end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please hope you do subscribe and drop your comments in the comment section down below. And please go back to check out. Um, any other missions that were run for the same campaign so go back to the battle report video and go down to the description and you can find a list of all the other videos there until next time we'll see you later